Welcome to To Your Health. I'm your host, Rhonda Alfred, and joining us on this episode is a special guest, Phyllis Peoples, President and CEO of Terrebonne General Health System. She's going to be talking to us today about the significance of National Hospital Week to our community during Terrebonne General's 70th anniversary. Welcome to the show, Phyllis. Thank you, Rhonda. Well, let's get started with you telling us a little bit more about yourself and your role at Terrebonne General for those who don't know you. Well, as you mentioned, I'm Phyllis Peoples, and I'm the president and CEO. I've been in this role for 21 years or a little greater. Um, it's been an amazing ride, I can tell you, as we continue to, to expand our organization and continue to move forward in our community. All right, well, this week is National Hospital Week. So we celebrate the week and we contribute so much to our community. Can you tell us a little bit more about why Terrebonne General celebrates Hospital Week? We're very excited about Hospital Week. Um, we do it every year, and it's an opportunity for us to say thank you to our employees, thank you to our community, thank you to our docs, volunteers, all the people that make a hospital successful. A hospital cannot run without the foundation of the people within it. So a week doesn't do justice, but it's a start. And so we have a lot of fun activities that we do. We uh, help people get engaged. Um, we do art shows. We do talent things. We, we try and give back in a variety of ways to make things it's fun. Your work family is a big part of your life. Um, it is. You can choose your own family. You can't always choose your work family. So we got to do a little extra. So how does Terrebonne General contribute to the community? Terrebonne General has been here, as you know, 70 years. It's our anniversary, and we're very excited about that. Mm -hmm. So for 70 years, we've been here taking care of our family and friends. And so our community is an amazing, amazing place that all of us want to be. But not only are we a hospital, but we have an extension throughout our community. We help people through wellness. We help people through screenings. We're here in case that you need us. We're here if you don't need us. Um, but we want to help educate our community, partner with our our others and the community who give back and make it a successful partnership for everybody here. Right, especially employees. Tell us a little bit more about the impact that the hospital has on employees. Well, employees yeah. are the foundation who we are because otherwise we're bricks and mortar. And I say that a lot. The hospital's nothing more than a building, but the people within it make us who we are. And it's nice for me to have the role that I have, um, but however, people don't look to me to take care of them at a bedside anymore. I used to do that a many long time ago, mm -hmm. but today that's not my expertise. But I do have the skill set of amazing physicians, nurses, clinicians, but in addition to that, they need a support system, whether it's our accounting or our housekeeping or our our business office, our financial part, all of that makes who we are. And so without our employees or the people who make us run, we're nothing more than a building. Right. And we do provide so many career opportunities for employees, as well as economic support for them. Terrebonne General is one of the largest employers within our community. We're the largest consolidated employer. We're close to 1,500 people here. Um, we have well to 350 physicians or more with a variety of specialties. And so our employees... Um, have a lot of opportunity. Our physicians have a lot of opportunity. We, we are always recruiting because we want the most, um, the biggest and the best and the most wonderful specialties here to provide for our community. Right, and for the impact on the patients. I know patients are always put first here at Terrebonne General and we have a huge impact. We have some of the only services in the region like a level three NICU and other things. Um, we recently expanded our cancer center and cardiology is a huge hub. We've had a relationship with CIS for six, for 41 years. So, I think um, our community uh, recognizes what we have to offer. A long time ago, and I'll say the old days because it was my parents' time, and so I'm getting to be their age, so I guess there's not old days. It depends who you have. My kids say I'm the old days, but we'll go down that road, right? Is mm -hmm. you had to leave our community to get some of those specialties that mm -hmm. today are right here close to home. As you mentioned, cardiology, we've been here for 41 years um, with a relationship. Orthopedics, a very expanded orthopedic.
therapeutic program here. We have the only NICU for a neonatal, neonatal intensive care unit for those babies that are born just a little bit premature that need an extra help. You can stay close to home. Yeah, um, we have one of the only hospitalist programs and intensivist programs within the region. And what that means is they are there at all times when you need care within your hospital or your intensive care unit. Somebody is in this organization as a medical staff member to take care of you. Mm -hmm. So at a moment's notice, we are here with the skill set that you need, and that has to be a comfort for you. Yes, and giving back is such a huge importance to Terrebonne General. Tell us some of the ways that we give back to our community. Uh, Terrebonne General is involved in every single sponsorship, walk, run, educational opportunity. That's a big thing for me. Relationships are very big for me. I value who we are and I value who we partner with, but most of all, I value who we take care of. So whether we sponsor you in a walk or a run or an educational seminar or helping to reach out, that's what we do. And you will see whether it's our marketing department, our physicians, our, our community, our team Terrebonne, we do everything to try and be a part because the hospital is a community. And we're not in a vacuum. We take care of our family and friends. We take care of our community. So whether we do it in a building, remember we are called a healthcare facility. That means we care for your health. And so that's a wide range of what we do. And, and we love doing it. Well, thank you so much for sharing this helpful information today and for all that you do for our community and for our health system. Thank you. I appreciate that. For more information on Terrebonne General Health System, visit tghealthsystem.com. Thanks for joining us on To Your Health. I'm your host, Rhonda Alford, and we will see you right back here next week.